Hi everyone, this is Dr. Ananya. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about symptoms of liver problems and symptoms that may indicate that you have a liver disease. Before beginning this video, I'd like you to subscribe to my channel so that I can share all the valuable and useful information with you. First of all, let us understand what is liver and what is the function of the liver. Liver is one of the most important organs of the body. It is situated just under your ribcage on the right side of upper abdomen. It is an organ of about the size of a football. Liver is essential for digesting the food and also removing the toxins from the body. Liver diseases can be inherited, which means they can be genetic. There are many other factors that may lead to liver diseases, such as being obese, viruses or using of alcohol. Long-term infection or damage to the liver can cause cirrhosis, that is the scarring of liver. And scarring of liver can lead to liver failure. Liver failure is a life-threatening condition, but it can be treated well if it is detected early. Now, let us talk about the symptoms of liver diseases. Number 1. Yellowish appearance of skin and eyes. Most of the people with liver diseases may develop jaundice. It is a condition in which the color of your skin and eyes become yellow. If you think you or someone you know is having jaundice, then you must immediately visit a doctor as this condition requires medical attention. Number 2. Pain in abdomen and swelling. Person with liver disease or liver problems can experience abdominal pain along with abdominal swelling. This swelling sometimes might be prominent in appearance. Liver damage can also lead to swelling in leg and ankles. Although there can be many other reasons why your legs or ankles are swollen, liver damage is one of them. Number 4. Itchy skin. Liver damage may also lead to itchy skin. Sometimes this itch can be very intense while sometimes it can be very dull. Again, skin itch can also be due to any other underlying health condition. So if you are having abnormal itching that may trouble you for a long time, then it's important for you to visit a doctor. Number 5. Dark colored urine. Liver damage may lead to color changes in the urine. Your urine is usually light yellow in color, but in case of liver damage, the color of the urine may become dark. Number 6. Pale stool. People with liver damage can see changes in the color of their stool. Number 7. Chronic fatigue. People with liver damage may experience chronic fatigue. Fatigue is a feeling of tiredness without doing any physical activity. There can be many other underlying health conditions that can lead to fatigue. Liver damage is one of them. Number 8. There can be nausea and vomiting. People usually experience nausea and vomiting and this may lead to loss of appetite. If you have these symptoms which you think are troubling you, then you must visit a doctor. Your doctor will ask for your medical history, will look for signs and symptoms, and will order some tests. These tests may involve liver function tests along with other blood tests. The final diagnosis will be based on the test results, your medical history, and the symptoms. If the diagnosis is not confirmed, your doctor will order other tests to find out the exact reason of the symptoms that have been troubling you. Later, your doctor might talk with you to develop a treatment plan that works best for you. So, are there any ways to prevent liver diseases? And the answer is yes. There are many ways by which you can prevent liver diseases. First of all, you must try not to drink. But in case if you drink, then you must always do in moderation. You must always avoid the things that you think are risk to your health. For example, always use condom while having sexual intercourse. The next one is avoiding multiple piercings and tattoos. And in case if you have tattoos and piercings, make sure it is done under clean and hygienic condition. Number three, getting vaccinated. If you think you are at risk of contracting hepatitis, then you must take a hepatitis vaccine. This will help your liver to protect it from hepatitis. Number four, using medications wisely. You must always take medications wisely. It means you must take prescribed or non-prescribed medication only when it is needed and in recommended doses. 
Also, if you are taking any herbal or vitamin supplements, make sure you talk to your doctor before starting any other medication. And the next method is to maintain a healthy lifestyle and a healthy weight. These are some of the common prevention methods which can help you to protect your liver. Along with this, here are a few things which you must know. Number one, always consult a doctor before starting or stopping any medication. I repeat, before starting or stopping any medication. Number two, it's important for you to tell your doctor about all the medications that you are taking, including the ODCs that includes paracetamol as well. Number three, during the time of diagnosis, it's important for you to tell your doctor clearly about your past medical history. And number four, always try to follow all the instructions given by the doctor and complete the whole course of the treatment and medication. You must always try not to miss any dosages. And in case if you miss any of the dosages, do not take the mixed dosage along with the next dosage. And that's all for today's video. If you have any questions or any suggestions, feel free to comment down below. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy.